greetings and welcome to our Rev Rumble and Roar. We're at SCOE's Transportation Department and we're going to share with you some of our buses. My name is Sherry, I will be with you and we also have Larissa and Sam. Hi guys. Okay, are you ready? Let's go look at some buses. Come on friends. Alright, this bus right here is a transit style school bus. Look how long our bus is. It is 40 feet long. See our big wheels? They are super big. That is why we never, never stand alongside of our school bus. The reason why it's a transit style bus is because our nose is flat on this bus. And we'll show you some other kinds of buses that have a nose. So come on in, friends. So this is the inside of our school bus. Look how many seats there are. We can transport lots of students. See how we have seatbelts in our bus? Always wear your seatbelt if you have a seatbelt. And this is Sam, and he's gonna show you the driver's compartment. Look at all our controls that we use. Sam's also gonna show us how to set up our lights outside so we can come to your bus stop nice and safe. Remember friends, when we get into our school bus this year, we have to wear our masks. So, I wanted to show you, this is called a bulkhead. Can you all say that, bulkhead? This is where we keep our emergency equipment. When you open it up, we have our fire extinguisher. We have reflective triangles up here. And these look like this. So if we break down outside, we can put these up. We also have an emergency equipment, a first aid kit that has all the requirements that we need in case we're in an accident and anybody gets injured. So on this bus, we have two horns. We have one regular horn, and then we have an air horn. Are you guys ready to hear it? It's pretty loud. Wow. Now, friends, Sam is going to show us how we use our lights to protect you while we're picking you up and dropping you off. First comes our amber lights. You see our yellow lights flashing? That means caution. Be careful. Then we pull up to your stop. And then our red lights come on, and our red lights mean stop. Look at our stop sign on the side. That's telling all the traffic to stop and be careful because we're loading or unloading our students. All right, this is our other bus. This bus is much shorter, but still we never stand beside our school buses. This type of school bus is called a conventional school bus. You see the nose? Any buses that have a nose that come out are called conventionals. All right, friends, let's go inside and see what it looks like. Remember, friends, when you get on our school buses, we must wear our masks. Notice this bus has fewer seats. That means it doesn't have as many. Some of our seats have special equipment to help our students stay nice and safe on the bus. Some just have a seat belt. This is our conventional bus. This is our driver's compartment for this type of school bus. Notice the controls are different, so we have to learn how to drive each school bus so we know all the controls about our bus. All right, so here's our third style school bus. This is a van style school bus. And you notice it has some special equipment and Sam's gonna show us how it works. So this will help students who are even in a wheelchair be able to ride the school bus, who can ride the school bus and still get to school with the rest of our students. This is called a ramp. And this is how it goes up and he can even take it down too. All right, he's gonna take us all the way up and then we'll meet you inside. All right, and you can see this bus is even smaller than the other buses. And this is how we load our students. They come in through here, and then we can put them back here and strap them down. Now we'll show you the driver's compartment. And now look at the driver's compartment in this bus. It looks almost like our car. 
but it has some extra buttons in there. That helps us get to your stop nice and safe. And friends, we also have Ethan here with us. He is the lead mechanic here at SCOE and he takes care of all of our school buses to make sure that they are working and in safe order so they're nice and safe. All right, friends. Well, I hope you had a good time at our transportation department and I hope you learned a lot about our school buses. See you next time.